What's up guys, this is Waleed and today's problem is the wind across roof. That's stupid. Anyway, so there's a wind that goes over the roof over here and it has velocity of 25.5 .5 meter per second and the area of the roof is 37.3 meter squared and the density of the air is 1.28. So what's the pressure differential across the top and the bottom of the roof. So they gave us also that the wind inside the house is at rest. Okay, so V inside is going to be, so let's see, V out, V in, zero. So we'll do this equation. So P, we'll call it out, plus half density of the air let me call it air let me write it in a different way so p out plus half p of the air v out squared it's going to be equal to p n plus half P air V N squared. So this one goes to zero because the V is zero. And to find the differential is P out minus P N is going to be equal to the half P air V out squared. It could be negative or positive, it doesn't matter because they're looking at a differential. So you could do this as uh, when you take to the other side, it's going to be negative. But then you can give it positive and you can switch those guys because they're only asking about differential. Okay. So for me, it's half times air 1.28 times V out is 25.5 squared. So this guy got 416.16 Pascal. Okay. And then, what's the net left force on the roof due to the storm? Okay, so we know that the force is equal to pressure times area. So we have the area, which is 37.3, and we have the pressure outside, so 416.16 times 37.3. And for this guy, I got 15522.76 Newton. Alright guys, hope this helped, makes sense. I'll see you in the next video. Good luck.